take down the 30 foot obstacle course, you're gonna first turn off the blower and then you're gonna go around and um, open up all the, uh, all the tubes and also the deflation flaps. Now on these obstacles, there's normally about two uh, inflation tubes and two deflation flaps, two or three of them. And uh, just make sure you open them all up so that the air can quickly exit. Just to make for a faster takedown. As you can see, the air is quickly coming out of this unit. Air want to go around to the corners and uh, remove these hooks. I mean, remove the stakes. Then you can get some people to start walking on the unit to quickly push the air out. This is a great time to get all the kids who are jumping around into the, uh, get them to help. You're going to want to make sure you take your shoes off before you start walking on this unit. Just put on your shoes and down the or step it up anyway. Now he's seaming the side right now, and this will just make for an easy roll. If you pull the material so that, uh, just get this side straightened out so you can see the seam. There's no excess material hanging over it. Not only does this make for an easier roll, but it also protects the material once the unit's rolled. If you have, uh, if you have the ladder vinyl hanging out of the roll, then, uh, you know, it could get snagged or scratched or something like that. And you're going to want to seam all sides of the unit the side, the front, the other side, and the back. Now once it's, uh, it's fairly deflated, you're going to go ahead and grab this side and pull it in. Uh, close to the middle, just over though. We're gonna fold it in thirds. So you go ju just past the middle. Now you grab the other side and you pull it on top of the side already folded. Just like that. And now you're really gonna to wanna to start walking on the unit uh, just to push all that air out. Now before you roll, you're going to want to make sure all the, uh, the deflation, or the inflation tubes, rather, are uh, pointed towards the exit, because you're going to roll from the entrance to the exit. If they're pointed all that way, the air can just easily escape. You want to get a, you're going to want to get the straps ready. Uh, we just tuck them under there like that. And uh, they're going to be hanging out this back side. And that way, once you roll it, um, it'll just make for an easy, uh, an easy strap. Now you're going to roll from the entrance to the exit, the exact way it was unrolled. And it's great if you can have somebody walk just to push down that material as you roll. If you can get two people rolling, that's great. You can do it with one person. You're going to want to roll as tight as you can. And uh, this will just make it easier to get in the bag and easier to, uh, to maneuver, get it back into your vehicle. It is building up a little bit. It's just good to just push it all out. And the longer this unit sits out, the, uh, you know, the better it will deflate, especially in the sun. You have to sit out maybe 30 minutes, it'll be very easy to roll. All right, once it's rolled, you're gonna unroll it just a little bit. And you're gonna tuck all that extra material back into the unit. Again, this will just protect it and uh, keep it from getting snagged or anything before it gets into the bag. Then you're gonna roll the unit right back over the material and it is ready to be strapped. Pull the straps down as you can, just keep the unit tight. And now that it's strapped, you can uh, stand the unit up and get the bag ready.
and that bag should go over the unit quite easily if it's rolled correctly. It just falls right over the unit. Once it's on there, you can flip the unit. And stand it right back up again, that way you can tie the bag. Just to keep it secure. And once the bag is on there, you can push it back over and roll it off the stomp so you can begin cleaning that up. And as you remember, we, uh, we staked all four corners down. Just make sure you pull these stakes up. You can, uh, you can use a crowbar, or sometimes the ground's soft enough to just pull them right out of the ground. And once all the stakes are removed from the tarp, it's ready to be folded. And now the unit is, uh, it's been taken down and you are ready to bring it back.